Hi guys, hello and welcome to another tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how you can download a picture from the internet to your local computer. So right now I'm sitting at google.com and looking for a picture about office setup. After I do a simple search, I will click on the images and under images, I will now be selecting images that are not backed by any copyrights. So I'll click the tools and go under usage rights and choose creative common licenses. That's located under tools, usage rights, creative common licenses. Now I only get those images. Then whichever picture I want to use, I can simply click on that picture and download it. I will show you two different examples. This is a picture that I am picking directly from Google. So I will simply right click on the picture and choose save as. I can give this image a different name or I could just leave it on its default name and simply hit save. Once I'm done with that, let me show you another example. This is a picture that is coming from a website pxhere.com. pxhere.com gives you royalty free pictures that you can download without a problem. However, when you search for these pictures on Google, all you do is you, you see a little snip snapshot, which is not very high quality. The actual image, as you can see, is 4,000 by 2,669 pixels. However, this picture is not very crisp. So you actually visit the site to download this picture. When you're here, you can right click on the picture and choose save image as. Again, you could name it whatever you like to name it. But be careful that the save as type by default is JPG exclamation mark D. This will not save your image as a picture. So you should pick all files from here and then change Office 2 to Office 2.jpg or PNG, whatever format you prefer, and then hit the save button. That way you will picture, your picture will be saved as a picture. Let me show you if you do not do that and you just simply let's say name the picture as office three and leave JPG exclamation D as it is and hit the save button. Then what it does, you can see that it's not even an image. If you double click on it, windows can't even open it. However, the other two, they're perfectly fine and you can open them and view them and use them. So anyway, this is a short tutorial just to show you that how you can download pictures from the internet. Tell me in the comment section below, what are your thoughts on this tutorial? And if you want me to do more tutorials like this, give me some suggestions, your inputs. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.